What's up, my ninjas? This is me, Testament, back ready to go kick some gift ass on behalf of the Salarian troop. Shadow is on the ground. Repeat, Shadow is on the ground. Shadow is on the ground. Shadow is about to be laid down. Tunnel by is under Look coordinated crossfire. Check for long range turrets helping the guest target. Mm hmm, we'll check for all that. How about we just run in there and kill everybody? That's what I like to do. Run and gun, baby. Woo wee! Sniping with the pistola. Ooh, hello. Ooh. Damn, who was that shoot like that? Whoa. My team, they just uh, so done, huh? They say pop, 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 pop. Got a couple of commando chicks with me. They shooting to the job done. See that? That crazy. Alright, that ought to do it. My singularity should be strong. Yep, there we go. So, a bit of bad luck. I uh, want to talk to you guys about finally dealing with that uh, YouTube strike shit. Where, uh, well, not we ain't at that point yet, but um, I got a flag from EA on the previous video before this one, episode 16. Because Shepard talked to Rex. Alright, communications disrupted. Just wanna check out my grenades real quick while I talk to you guys. Um So they say that because I got the conversation between Shepard and Rex in my video that they flagged it and I can't put ads on that. Cause of one conversation. Okay. Now, if you look at the descriptions, I give full credit to EA, all that, whatever. Okay? And the same description will be, you know, on um, this video as well. Yeah, because of a conversation between Rex and Shepard, where I uh, basically tell Rex, I don't want to kill your ass, and then I don't. That's why my video got flagged. So with that being said, in order to prevent my channel from going through anything as far as getting uh, strikes on it or whatever, I'm just going to be removing ads from uh, something scrambled. They're targeting. Any you got of a my shot. Let's play Chief Williams, videos. take the heat off Manavai. Because uh, we're really just picking up steam, and I really don't feel like dealing with that type of stuff. You know, I already got flagged on my first. Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleeps video because of the intro song and I had to drop that and reload that I think we got and I might have got flagged again for it and don't even know but the point is it's ridiculous you know that I'm not claiming that the game belongs to me. Do you know? Watch for comm stations. I'm, I'm Williams, playing. do you see anything? Oh. I've lost shields. Well, I didn't even pop you when you say I lost shields. I know that's irrelevant, and I <laughs> shouldn't be losing my shields enough to even notice that. But still. I'm playing so reckless. I should have went Vanguard, because the way I play, so random. Oh, satellite uplink destroyed. That. Man, I wasn't even trying to do that. Oh, the enemy up there. Okay. And obviously you out of range. Everybody got to die now. Nah, oh. Probably about to die, pimp. And I could have swapped him through that up anyway. 
That's when the game's letting you know, yeah, pimp, you probably ain't gonna make it, brother. Wait a minute, okay. Now, I know that's leading somewhere. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, let's get it. I don't think I missed anything important in the other spot. Also, this video and the one after it, or maybe just the one after it, will probably be longer than normal. To recharge. Bump we, her up might, before they come back. we might crack an hour. I don't know. We might crack an hour. Because uh, I'm excited and I'm ready to get this thing going. And I'm ready to make Saren our little bitch. Sounds messed up, but it's the truth. Damn, still forgot to clear my inventory. Oh, okay. Alright, that's gonna be a problem. I have to take care of that before the end of this episode. So, what I'll probably do is just have a short little section where it'll be a brief pause and then we'll come back and my inventory will be a lot more clear. Damn, look at all these. Places to go. Okay, I'm gonna go to the refueling platform because I got a feeling that's important. Mostly because I don't pay attention or listen. <laughs> and then we'll go to the main area because it's always a side area that you gotta go to, right? Always gotta kick some ass somewhere else before you go kick the main asses. Oh yeah, and it must be important. Oh my god! Woo! Yet. Okay. Ooh -wee. They are not playing with my dumb ass, huh? All of them? That quick? Who did that? Damn! <laughs> I think so too, Tally. Got a feeling that's gonna make this a lot easier for us later on too. So, and we'll go sideways in because going head on, it's a bad idea. That's what all my party members keep telling me. Damn, I should have went Vanguard, y'all. I might have to switch to Vanguard. Um, when we start, no, I'm not gonna switch. I'm gonna stick to it. I was gonna say I might have to switch to Vanguard uh, when we start playing ME2. I like playing that deck. Even though I haven't been using my powers as, as much as I should in this game, I most definitely will um, when we get around to playing the next two because I like the way that they work better in those games. And uh, in truth, I started playing those games before I started playing uh, this one because I was. I've lost shield! So. I first started the Master Race series, all I got was a playable comic book. Oh, yeah. I had to deal with that until they decided, that, oh, we're going to release it. And then I just said, forget it and play it on PC before that happened. So this is why we're replaying it again on PC. And it's also the reason why um, we're not as proficient as this one at this one as we are at the others. So this is gonna be the spot where I quit clean my inventory and then I'll be right back with you guys. Alright. Do a new save real quick. And inventory. Okay, so now that we got rid of a bunch of upgrades that were clogging up our inventory that we won't use. Now we can pick up some more stuff, and I can't wear either of these. And 
neither can my crew. Wait, can Caden wear medium? I don't think Caden can wear medium armor. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Shit. If you're not sure, can't waste time on it. Alright, I know Liara and myself can't. But that's cool, because that uh, medium, heavy, and low stuff won't matter that much coming up soon. Once we take Saren out, and then we have to deal with the collectors. Shadow team must be getting close. Hold the line, men. Hold the line. Hold the line. That's the damn right. Oh, okay, what we got? Ammo upgrade. Shit, I just got rid of. I'm picking up more. Oh, swag. Swag out there quick. Okay. It's not like it's going to matter much. What's one? Might as well hold on to that. that big a deal we'll, we'll get back to it we're not gonna die I don't think I don't think we're gonna die famous last words right like I don't think we're gonna die and then everybody dies real quick I know somebody's about to die <laughs> for sure it's a guarantee access base All of these say the same thing? No, just that one. Okay, I guess we better stop uh, stop messing around then and get busy. We've got access to base security. We can cut the alarms from here. Maybe even trigger alarms on the far side of the base. It'll clear the guards out for us, but they might be too much for the Solarian teams to handle. Bigger than us. Williams can take a few more. Minimize the guard presence at the base. I hope they're ready for this. Oh, that was a renegade action. I thought that was just part of the damn. Wish I could take that back. But like I said, I'm uh playing like myself. So trying to be straight renegade or straight uh or a paragon but in and of itself it's not what we're going for the captain mentioned he had lost some men they were indoctrinated what's going on in this place indoctrination that is when the reapers basically oh my god uh mind freak like chris angel um shit out of uh, a living creature and um, when they like basically damn look how big these boys are for real for real that's crazy and none of that's important okay I guess I should have brought the guards here. Damn, I'm really regretting that, guys, because I don't mind having a little extra, you know, enemies to kill. It's not that big a deal. And I would have got some points for it, but... Yeah, huh? I don't know. Is someone out there? You still alive, Pimper? Whoa, 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 whoa. I got more than enough jail, so I'm just kind of skipping doing the shit myself. Where does this go? Okay. Outside. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. Wait, no, no, no. Where is this going? Is 
going to the same place as the elevator? What do you want? I told you everything. I... Who are you? Alliance, right? I knew someone would come. It tried to break me, but it couldn't. I shut it out. Whoa. Slow down. I need to know where you came from. Private Maino Savada of the 3rd Infiltration Regiment, STG, sir. Captured well on reconnaissance six days ago. Glad to answer, sir. Never any questions from these bastards. Just whispers and poking and cutting. I'd have said anything to get out and get some payback. That's not too much to ask, is it? A little payback? Can you help me, or will I be carrying you out of here? I'll be at your back every step of the way. I just need to get out of here and away from that incessant whispering. They've piped it in for days now. Something's not right here, Shepard. Setting him free could endanger the mission. No. No! I, I need to get out. This room is too small, and it keeps talking, and I really want to get out of here and get some work done. I need to get out. Let me out. Uh, I'm just going to end up having a kid. I can't take that chance. Can't take that chance. No chance. I need to do what it says. I have to. Let me out. Let me out! 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 How was that a renegade action? That I don't quite understand. Okay. So these are cell blocks. Those are Genophage labs. I don't quite understand how not letting the psycho out is a renegade action. I'm not gonna bitch. I'm just gonna kill some stuff. That's all. It made me feel better. Where you at, man? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Crazy as hell. Yo, all you got on is a lab coat and you just ran up on me. You know you indoctrinated, huh? Okay, so this is where they making Krogan's. Uh, so they tougher. What's really going on out here? Got some new pistols. And some more guns. And we gonna end up overcrowded oh some only need one because it's two of the same thing and then we'll uh, get one to Rex once we get a chance okay I guess I came down here too early Ooh, another brawler. Okay, we'll take it all. Sort it out later again. Nothing to hack. We'll take the elevator this time. And hopefully we're going the right way, because I feel like if this game was in real time, which I'm glad it's not, my, that whole extra squad would be dead as shit. Oh, my God. Y'all in here making husks? Ain't that a biscuit eater? Oh, this is not cool. What is going on here? Where are the guards? Where is Sarah? No, stay back. This is important work. This is the is. glorious salvation of my species. Oh, so that's why you know. You will not really destroy the work we have started. 
Oh, we got some bionic amps. I'm going to check those out. Because you really believed that Saren was on your side and was trying to help you rebuild your race. Mm. It's a damn shame what people will do if they think it'll help. I feel bad for the Krogan low-key. I mean, they could be real assholes when they want to be. But that don't mean that you uh, neuter their whole race like damn. You know? I'm not going to start soapboxing or nothing, but still, you know? <laughs> Good, and then this way, I think we're starting to make some leeway, y'all. Oh, I hate that I do that almost every time. Okay, this is us, and this is where we're going. So, I'll just put a marker there. Now that we finally know what the hell we're doing. Oh, my God. I just want to get out of here before it's too late. I'm not going to hurt you. Who are you? Ranathanoptis, neurospecialist. But this job isn't worth dying over, or worse. <laughs> you think the indoctrination only affects prisoners? Sooner or later, Saren will want to dissect my brain, too. Okay. I thought this was a breeding facility. Not this level. We're studying Sovereign's effect on organic minds. At least that's what I assumed. Saren kept us in the dark as much as possible. You helped him and you do not even know why? I didn't have the option of negotiating. This position is a little more permanent than I had expected. But I can help you. This elevator behind me goes to Saren's private lab. I can get you in. See? Full access. All of Saren's private files. Are we good? Can I go? What were you studying here? It's that ship, Sovereign. It emits some kind of signal. Undetectable, but it's there. I've seen the effects. Saren uses it to influence his followers, to control them. It's called indoctrination. Direct exposure to the signal turns you into a mindless slave, like the Solarian test subjects. But there's collateral damage, too. What do you mean by collateral damage? Sovereign's signal is too strong. Spend too much time near the ship and you feel it, like a tingle at the back of the skull. It's like a whisper you can't quite hear. You're compelled to do things, but you don't know why. You just obey. Eventually, you just stop thinking for yourself. It happens to everyone at the facility. My first test subject was the man I replaced. Now I just want to get out of here before it happens to me. That's logical. Tell me more about this signal. Mm -hmm. Signal's not exactly the right word. There is some kind of energy field emanating from the ship. It changes thought patterns. Over time, days, maybe a week, it weakens your will. You become easier to manipulate and control, but it's a degenerative condition. There's a balance between control and usefulness. The less freedom a subject maintains, the less capable it becomes. Why is Saren researching this? Isn't he the one controlling it? The signal comes from the ship. It makes us obey Saren, but I don't think he controls it. Not exactly. I think he's scared it might be affecting him. Hmm. Indoctrination is subtle. By the time the effects become noticeable, it's usually too late. That's interesting. I'm going to let you go simply for the fact that the last two times I did... I'm going to blow this place to me. hell and gone. If you want to make it out alive, you better start running. What? You can't... But I'll never... Ah! I believe you enjoyed that, Shepard. I thought I was about to get upset, y'all, because I thought that we was about to take a L. For telling her that we was going to blow the place up, but I'm like, but how? Okay, what the hell is going on with that? <laughs> oh, we on the elevator. We might as well look at some of these new guns. All right, 
right, so what we got here? No. That brawler has better. Same damage with better shots and accuracy. Time to switch over. And what about my amp? Whoa. Oh, but it doesn't hit as hard. That's okay, we use it to throw stuff around, so that means it'll stay there longer. No armor for good old me. Let's check out Tally and her shotgun. Shotguns as good as it's gonna get, girl. Liara needs a better gun. Uh, oh no, she got a good gun. Yeah, that that damage boost ain't enough to to substantially make me want to change what you got. But for you, it is Tally. So, oh, you got a shotgun with no bonuses. Damage. I want her to shoot and, and stuff die like immediately. Do a heat sink. And. So I can X cryo. So I got the tongues. Yeah, tungstens. Speaking of which, do I got that on mine? The right tungsten? Oh! Okay, that's the wrong gun. I got. Number six is, do I got anything better than six, the tungsten rounds? Got the sevens. All right, and then my girlfriend. What you got, you got armor piercing. Ooh, hell no, sweetheart. I'm gonna give you some tungstens. Hold on. Uh-uh. There we go. Okay, I think everybody pretty good. Let's check, see. None of this armor, none of us can wear. Alright, let's get funky, yo. There's a mod to make elevator trips shorter, but I passed it over because I was Shepherd, afraid. Shepard, look over here. It's another beacon, like the one on Eden Prime. Oh, shiza. Okay, it's time to touch that and scramble my brain. All right, y'all catch me now because I'm about to scramble my brain, and I hope I don't die. Okay, so y'all gotta be here for me. Hopefully we don't get flagged for this cutscene for talking to the damn man. Damn me. Ooh, Shepard a boss this time. He just accepted that shit like, hmm. So we ain't gonna talk about this, big fella? Okay. I get the feeling something bad is about to happen. Just a conversation. You are not Saren. You are correct. What is that? Some kind of VI interface? Rudimentary creatures of blood and flesh. You touch my mind, fumbling in ignorance, incapable of understanding. I do not think this is a VI. There is a realm of existence so far beyond your own, you cannot even imagine it. I am beyond your comprehension. I am Sovereign. Hmm. Sovereign isn't just some Reaper ship Saren found. It's an actual Reaper. Reaper, a label created by the Protheans to give voice to their destruction. In the end, what 
what they chose to call us is irrelevant. We simply are. The Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. You could not have been there. It's impossible. Organic life is nothing but a genetic mutation. Damn. An accident. Your lives are measured in years and decades. You wither and die. We are eternal. The pinnacle of evolution and existence. Before us, you are nothing. Your extinction is inevitable. We are the end of everything. Um... Shit, I am scared, so I'm not... <laughs> I would be scared as hell. But, uh... I, my homie's got my back. There is an entire galaxy of races united and ready to face you. Confidence born of ignorance. The cycle cannot be broken. Cycle? What cycle? The pattern has repeated itself more times than you can fathom. Organic civilizations rise, evolve, advance, and at the apex of their glory, they are extinguished. The Protheans were not the first. They did not create the Citadel. They did not forge the mass relays. They merely found them. The legacy of my kind. So you, okay, so y'all made the mugs, huh? Why would you construct the mass relays, then leave them for someone else to find? Your civilization is based on the technology of the mass relays. Our technology. By using it, your society develops along the paths we desire. We impose order on the chaos of organic evolution. You exist because we allow it. And you will end because we demand it. Damn. They are harvesting us. Letting us advance to the level they need, then wiping us out. Why? What do you want from us? Slaves? Resources? My kind transcends your very understanding. We are each a nation. Independent. Free of all weakness. You cannot even grasp the nature of our existence. Where did you come from? Who built you? We have no beginning. We have no end. We are infinite. Millions of years after your civilization has been eradicated and forgotten, robot, you we know where you will endure. Where did you come Oops, from? Sorry, didn't mean to repeat Who that. built you? We have no beginning. We have no end. There we go. We are infinite. Millions of years after your civilization has well, been eradicated well, well, and forgotten, we will endure. Sure you will. Where are the rest of the Reavers? Are you the last of your kind? We are Legion. The time of our return is coming. Our numbers will darken the sky of every world. You cannot escape your doom. Don't worry. You're not even alive. Not really. You're just a machine. And machines can be broken. Your words are as empty as your future. Damn. I am the vanguard <laughs> That's so of your destruction. <laughs> your this exchange are... is <laughs> over. Commander, we got trouble. Let me know. Hit me, Joker. That ship's sovereign? It's moving. I don't know what you did down there, but that thing just pulled a turn that would shear any of our ships in half. It's coming your way, and it's coming hard. You need to wrap things up in there fast. Damn, he ready to beat my ass? No longer functioning. Ideas, Commander Shepard? Uh, yeah, we gotta Let's get head to the here. breeding facility. Joker can pick us up look. after we set the nuke. Sovereign of G, I ain't gonna lie. He was mad as hell. He was like, oh, so you talking that shit, uh, Shepard? Watch me come on and hit this Yui real quick and kill your ass. I 
Smith returning from your position, Jay Eto. Looks like Shadow picked a sensitive spot. Williams, head them off. Hold them. Oh shit. The dude just get killed? Some like dude just got popped. Moving. Damn, burned out that quick. Alright, since I got this new amp, this shit should work a lot longer. Aha! Running gun, baby! Wait, damn, did I just run past my damn point I was supposed to go? No, I'm not sure. I did. Wait. Oh, but yeah, they. Damn it! I don't know what's going on. Oh, okay. I do know what's going on. I'm on the right way. That's why they raised the bridge. Okay. It's kind of leading me and babying me because my dumb ass need that. I see. So we headed to the bridge facility. Let's get rid of this marker because it's gonna drive us nuts. He said that's what we were rendezvous. I think. Right? Yeah. Read the facility, not the labs. What I do like about the next game is the fact that all bypasses and stuff you just do manually, so it don't matter what class you got with you, what characters, whatever. You just do you just do it. And then that's it. That turret could punch some nasty holes in the Normandy. Shit. Where that sniper come from? Show froze just then. All right. Watch out! They have followed us up the elevator. I'm getting nervous. I just don't know. That's it. We need to clear the gap and set those charges. Oh, damn. As soon as I open the door. I ain't got time for this type of shit. I hate these jumping things. Damn. I just... Set. Everyone bunker down. Bunker down. Shit about to get real, y'all. All right. Nice work. That's one less thing to worry about. Commander, I'm bringing us in. I'll get as close to the site as I can.
Linko. Linko. So I wonder if our armor is good enough for our feet not to be getting wet right now. I think stupid stuff, but that's a, that's a, I think that's a good question. Is our armor so secure that our Bomb feet are getting wet? Bomb is in position. Wet? We're all set here. Commander, can you read me? The nuke is almost ready. Get to the rendezvous point, Williams. Negative, Commander. The Geth have us pinned down on the AA tower. We've taken heavy casualties. We'll never make the rendezvous point in time. Get them out of there, Joker. Now! Negative! It's too hot! Can't risk it! We'll hold them off as long as we can- It's okay, Commander. I need a couple of minutes to finish arming the bomb. Go get them and meet me back here. Up to the AA tower. Move. Squad, put him in the coffin. Literally, cause uh, somebody about to die. Straight up. Oh. Real quick, since we just love. And now we got two. I don't know where to throw those little two points at. Um, okay, yeah. Healing is important. And get your damage up some, boo. As far as me, uh, all right. Let's rock it like a team, y'all. On my ass, y'all. <laughs> he was like, "What's good, pimp? What's really good? I'm about to push you down, Tez. I'm about to knock your weak ass out." And you know what? He was right. He had my number. For real though. But uh, a little bit of focus went a long way. That could have been the end. So, I guess we're going to go through the motions. It appears the Geth have sent reinforcements. Heads up, LT. We just spotted the troop ship headed to your location. It's already here. There's Geth pouring out all over the bomb site. Can you hold them off? There's too many. I don't think we can survive until you get here. I'm activating the bomb. Alenko, what are you doing? I'm just making sure this bomb goes off, no matter what. It's done, Commander. Go get Williams and get the hell out of here. Screw that. We can handle ourselves. Go back and get Alenko. So who do I save, y'all? Decisions, decisions. Now, normally, since this is a male playthrough, I would save Ashley. But I'm not dating Ashley. And I want to learn more about Kate in this playthrough. So, we're going to save Kate. Malenko, radio Joker and tell him to meet us at the bomb site. Yes, Commander. I, I... You know it's the right choice, LT. I'm sorry, Ash. I had to make a choice. I understand, Commander. And then I waste time, and then both of y'all end up getting killed because I get lost. <laughs> that would suck <laughs> if that was actually an option in a game where, uh, since you didn't know where the hell you were going, they both end up just flat out dying. See, now, ME2, ME2 would do that to you. It'd be like, guess what, stupid? You don't know what the hell you're going for. Everybody die now. 
since you made bad decisions. And that's what would happen. You know, I've seen people play ME2 playthroughs where everybody died, including me and himself. Shepard jumped to go to the ship, missed, straight up died. All right, y'all, let's ante up, because as soon as we get through this door, it's about to get real. All right, come on, let's let's do this, Lily. I call Liara Lily because that's actually my fiance's nickname. Her name's Lily. I call her. Lily, so. Ooh, shit, he ran right past me, huh? This is such a stupid way to go about this, <laughs> but it's fun. Swag. Come on, shield. Diversion. Of course, it was all for nothing. I can't let you disrupt what I've accomplished here. Uh. You can't possibly understand what's really at stake. Why are you doing this? You've seen the vision from the beacon, Shepard. You of all people should understand what the Reapers are capable of. They cannot be stopped. Do not mire yourself in pointless revolt. Do not sacrifice everything for the sake of the Protheans tried to fight, and they were utterly destroyed. True. Trillions dead. But what if they had bowed before the invaders? Would the Protheans still exist? Is submission not preferable to extinction? That's not what it's going to be. They say they want us dead, pimp. Do you really believe the Reapers will let us live? Now you see why I never came forward with this to the Council. We organics are driven by emotion instead of logic. We will fight even when we know we cannot win. But if we work with the Reapers, if we make ourselves useful, think how many lives can be spared. Once I understood this, I joined Sovereign. Though I was aware of the dangers, I had hoped this facility could protect me. You're afraid Sovereign is influencing you. Yeah, I mean, your dumb You're ass, afraid bro. he's controlling your thoughts. I've studied the effects of indoctrination. The more control Sovereign exerts, the less capable the subject becomes. That is my saving grace. Sovereign needs me to find the conduit. My mind is still my own. For now. But the transformation from ally to servant can be subtle. I will not let it happen to me. It's too late, Doug. It's already happened. Sovereign's manipulating you and you don't even know it. You're already under its power. No, Sovereign needs me. If I find the conduit, I've been promised a reprieve from the inevitable. This is my only hope. Help me, dog. Together we can stop Sovereign. We don't have to submit to the Reapers. We can beat them. I no longer believe that, Shepard. The visions mm -hmm. cannot be denied. The Reapers are too powerful. The only hope of survival is to join with them. It's always hope, bro. Sovereign is a machine. It thinks like a machine. If I can prove my value, I become a resource worth maintaining. There is no other logical conclusion. And how are you supposed to become... How are you supposed to be worthy, dog? Why are the Geth following Sovereign? They believe Sovereign to be some kind of god. The pinnacle their own evolution but the reaction of their deity is most telling it is insulted yeah. sovereign does not desire the pitiful devotions the geth hurl at it they are just tools and no amount of belief on their part will change that but as tools they are useful they will survive the coming invasion if organic life is to survive we must also prove we are useful 
we must work with the Reapers. Tell me why Sovereign needs the Conduit. Tell me what it is. Maybe we can find a way to stop them. The Conduit is the key to your destruction and my salvation. Not quite. Sovereign needs my help to find it. That is the only reason I have not been indoctrinated. You were a Spectre. You were sworn to defend the galaxy. Then you broke that vow to save yourself. Pussy. Basically. <laughs> I'm not doing this for myself. Don't you see? Sovereign will succeed. It is inevitable. My way is the only way any of us will survive. Mm -hmm. I'm forging an alliance between us and the Reapers. Girl, between organics your body, and your machines. Skin. And in doing so, I will save more lives than have ever existed. So I'm wondering now. But you would undo my work. You would do our Are entire civilization free to complete between the machine and organic. And for that, like later on in the series. Die. Who are you talking about? Almost die. Oh shit. Me apparently. Fuck ya. There. Hope you like your pimp just for you. Get your shields back. Alright, let's do it. Whoa, come on now. Yeah, we got my gun, man. Oh, 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 cuz. Hey, who's hey, who, 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 Go with this ass, let's go! ass bitch and Ashley had more balls than him because she was willing to stay. I can't believe that Ash didn't make it. How could we just leave her down there? Williams knew the risks going in. She gave her life to save the rest of us. But why me? Why not her? It wasn't your call, Olenko. I had to choose. I chose you. But if I'd done my job, you wouldn't have had to make that call. That's not true, pimp. It wasn't your fault. It wasn't my fault. The only one to blame here is Saren. That's right. Duh. Yes, sir. I'm... We'll get it done. You damn right we Commander, will. excuse me for interrupting, but I have an idea. I think the beacon you found in Saren's base was similar to the one you found on Eden Prime. Uh-huh. It may have filled in the missing pieces of your vision. I might be able to help you put all those pieces together. Let's do it, baby. You want to join our minds again, don't you? I do. Okay, go ahead. Not at all unpleasant. <laughs> it was unexpected, but not at all unpleasant. Relax, Commander. Mm -hmm. Embrace eternity. So I decided to show our brows are just markings. That's, I don't know what's up with that. Shit. 
This looked like a Dante's Inferno nightmare to me. Or um, a nightmare from Agony, this new game coming out called Agony. Look forward to playing that, it looks scary as hell. You, uh, a soul stuck in hell, you gotta try to figure out a way to get out. Incredible. I, I never thought the images would be so intense. I need a moment to collect myself. Did the right, vision make any sense to you? Tell me what you need to see. It's a distress call. A message sent out across the Prothean Empire. A warning against the Reapers, but the warning came too late. Damn. Anything else? What about the conduit? There were other images, locations, places I recognized from my research. Ilos! The conduit is on Ilos! That is why Saren needed to find the Mu Relay. It is the only way to get to Ilos. How come you never told us about Ilos before? The Mu Relay links to dozens of systems and hundreds of worlds. How was I to know Ilos was the one we wanted? Without the cipher, the images in your visions were never clear. Only now do I recognize them as landmarks from Ilos. Makes sense. We need to get to Ilos. Forget it. The Mu Relay's inside the Terminus systems. Alliance ships are not welcome there. Neither are Spectres. The conduits on Ilos, that's where Saren is heading. I'll be waiting for him when he gets there. That's right, because I'm a will have his entire Dude. fleet orbiting Ilos. Oh, okay. You will never make it down to the surface without reinforcements. Did you not see you me thug him? the council. We need a fleet to... Oh. I am sorry. The joining is... exhausting. I should go to the medical bay and lie down for a moment. You okay, sweetie? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. That will not be necessary. I just need some rest. Somewhere quiet. Oh, hey, We're done here. Dismissed. Commander, there's a comm buoy nearby. I can link us in if you want to report back to the Citadel Council. You know, to warn them about Sovereign. Yeah, I'll tell they punk ass. Set you the link up, Joker. Out of thing, they to need to it. know. Patching it through. Andrew Shepard, I'm pleased to see your mission on Vermeer was a success. Saren is formidable enough without an army of Krogan serving under him. We got much bigger problems, y'all. The Krogan would have served Sovereign, a Reaper. Yes, we saw mention of this on your report. Sovereign, a sentient machine, a true artificial intelligence. This news is quite alarming, if it turns out to be accurate. It's accurate. Sovereign's a Reaper. Saren admitted it. He's playing you, Shepard. Saren still has contacts on the Citadel. You probably saw your earlier reports. The ones talking about your vision and the Reapers. It's highly possible Saren is using false information to throw you off balance. Our own intelligence has never turned up any corroborating information. Oh, I, wanna, I just want to hang up on the ass so bad. So what do you need? You need proof? Sooner or later, you're going to have to take something I say on faith, Counselor. Try to see this from our perspective, Commander. Saren is a threat we can recognize. However, as far as we know, the Reapers only exist in your visions. Mm -hmm. Our decisions affect trillions of lives. We cannot act on the accusations of a single person, even a specter. Not without solid evidence. The Council dead, cannot take here. any official action here. That is why we created the Spectres. You have the authority to act as you see fit. If you truly believe Sovereign is the real threat, you must take whatever steps are necessary to stop it. And Saren. Good luck, Commander. From all of us. Yeah, of course. So as usual, uh, we get hit with the company line and no help, because that's just what the Council do, which is why uh, they ass ain't gonna be around much longer. Real talk. Um, I do remember that, and I do remember that that's the choice I get to make, and that's what I'm gonna do. I forwarded the mission update to the Citadel, Commander. We got confirmation on those reinforcements. Ambassador Udino wants us to report back to the Citadel. The Council's massing a joint species fleet to deal with Saren and his gap. Alright, cool. We'll do that. Back to the Citadel, Joker. I want the Normandy at the head of that fleet. Yes, sir. Cool beans. Uh, I don't play that shit. Uh, <laughs> Y'all done seen, I done showed you. 
time and time again, over and over, that what I say is that real, and what I say is the truth. And it's funny that we only been a part of uh, the uh, Galactic Alliance for such a short time. Because good job, know, Shepard. Thanks to you, the everybody Council is finally died. taking real action against Saren. The ambassador is correct. If Saren is foolish enough to attack the Citadel, as you believe, we will be ready for him. Patrols are stationed at every mass relay linking Citadel space to the Terminus systems. Mm -hmm. How many ships are you sending to attack Ilos? Ilos is only accessible to the Mule Relay, deep inside the Terminus systems, Commander. If we send a fleet in there, the only possible outcome is full-scale war. Now is the time for discretion, Commander. Saren's greatest weapon was secrecy. Exposed, he is no longer a threat. This is over. No, no, it's not. You're an idiot. I've I've been trying to tell you. Oh my God! Get One emotional. ship going into the terminus systems won't start a war. I can be discreet. You detonated a nuclear device on Vermeer. I wouldn't call that discreet. Your style served you well in the Traverse, Commander. We recognize that. But Ilos requires a deft touch. We have the situation under control. No, no, you don't. Secrecy isn't his greatest weapon. The conduit is. Saren is a master manipulator. The conduit is just a distraction from his real plan to attack the Citadel. If Saren finds the conduit, we're all screwed. We have to go to Ilos. Ambassador Udina, I get the sense Commander Shepard isn't willing to let this go. There are serious political implications here, Shepard. Humanity's made great gains thanks to you, but now you're becoming more trouble than you're worth. You bastard! You're selling us out! It's just politics, Commander. You've done your job, now let me do mine. We've locked out all the Normandy's primary systems until further notice you're grounded. Motherf- Are you insane? After everything I've done, you still don't believe me? I think it's time for you and your team to leave, Commander. This no longer concerns you. The Council can handle this, with my help, of course. Stupid motherfuckers, I swear. Hey girl, what's up? Commander. Shepard. I cannot believe they did this to you. I am so sorry. It's not your fault. It's boy. not your fault. It's not right. You did everything they asked and more. Nobody else could have done what you did. Show you right. The council owes you everything, everything. Instead, they strip you of your command and ground the Normandy. I don't care if they ground me, but they refuse to go after Saren. If they don't stop him from finding the conduit, we're all dead. Perhaps we could appeal and get them to reverse their decision. I pushed them as hard as I could. They wouldn't budge. So you're going to walk away? You will just give up and doom the entire galaxy to extinction? That's right. We're out of the game for now. <laughs> but I'll find a way back in. I believe in you, Shepard. I am with you every step of the way. Oh, it's time, baby. Sorry to interrupt, Commander. Got a message from Captain Anderson. Joker, 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 Joker. Dog, you... Oh, my God. What did he want? Only said to meet him in that club in the wards. Flux. You should probably go meet with him. I'm just... <sighs> Equalizing interior pressure with exterior atmosphere. <clears throat> Logged. The commanding officer is ashore. Exo Presley yeah, has the deck. deck. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna get ready to end it here. This episode's already longer than usual, but I said that would happen. So no surprises here. Um, give me a like. Give me a subscribe. Hit me up. Um, we making a lot of progress and a lot of leeway, and we almost at the end now. Uh, we at that final stretch, and uh, and then we'll be moving in important in migrating this character over to me2 and then we'll start that playthrough um i got some other videos on the shelf coming out some top tens and 
uh, other type of things besides just let's play so we starting to grow guys and I appreciate you for being there with me um, and as always keep it funky and later my ninjas